right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily Call of Duty content. And I'm not playing around because, look, I realize that most of my fans are Call of Duty fans. Why I got two mics? Don't worry about that, man. Maybe I'm about to spit some bars or something down here. I realize that a lot of my fans are Call of Duty fans. You guys are the ones that brought me to the forefront, lifted me up, did all of this stuff, man. So, look, I realized something the other day when I was playing this game. I realized that I really like this game. Contrary to popular belief, I really like this game. I think it's one of the best Call of Duties ever made, especially mechanically. I'll talk about all this stuff in the video. But I, I, I don't know, man. I, I gave it another chance the other day, and I'm really digging the game. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, Especially with the new maps and stuff like that, man. But look, if y'all want to continue Call of Duty content, can I get a thousand likes or something? Most of my fans are Call of Duty fans. That's why my 2K videos don't do that well. So I'm figuring if I do a good Call of Duty video, do my due diligence and all of this stuff, maybe I can get, maybe I can get some views. Maybe I can't. We'll see, man. But look, whether or not I continue to put up Call of Duty content is totally dependent upon you guys. You gotta watch the videos. You're gonna have to like the videos. You're gonna have to be active in the comments. Do a welcome back, Jay, or something down there in the bottom just so I know that y'all ain't never leaving and you love me and you ain't never left your boy like your boy left you. I'm sorry. The game was not fun for me, but now I know more about YouTube. I know how to do YouTube videos. I know the, the, the content and the subjects to do them on. So the views for should be easy. I just need y'all to hit the like. That's the only thing I can't make y'all do. I can I can click bait you in and make you like the video, watch the video, but I can't make you like it. So if you can like the video for me, man, that would be awesome. But um, other than that, man, hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get right into it. This is gonna be a, li a fake live commentary where I'm here and I'm gonna be commentating the video. So let's get it. This is a team deathmatch on vacant, man. And I am so happy that they added these other these other joints in hold on wait a minute, minute. jay-z fans back for all right yes and it counts two piece uh, bro it ain't no different the game ain't no different it's like nothing ever changed when i play these maps you got scrubs in front of you you got people holding corners look at the dude down the corner down the hallway want to do look once i Realize, whoo, get get dropped. You are terrible, my guy. Hip fire, hip fire. Once I realized that you have to play this game a certain way, like Thunder said, in order to be successful, I started enjoying the game. I'm not gonna lie, especially on these small maps, because on these small maps, bro, look at that. Look, my reaction time has always been good enough to duck those. Hell, tell that bad boy in the corner to get from Ronya, cause we a dangerous. Whoa! My, my time, my reaction time has always been good enough. Look, what are you doing? Hip fire, hip fire! And I got body. My reaction time has always been good enough to dodge those, uh, to dodge the bouncing betters and duck, duck up under them. But you know, in uh, Black Ops 2, people couldn't do it, so they had to, they, they literally had to make it nerf those so people could do something. But look, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, man. I love, I'm loving this game. Ooh, what's that? What's that? One piece? What you doing in the counter? Two piece? Uh, you can't jump over that. That boy King Slayer called me Jamie Lannister. But look. I've enjoyed this game so much because with these new levels, the new maps, they condense everything down. It ain't a whole lot of places to hide. If you do want to hide, get dropped in the doorway. If you do want to hide, two piece, eh? if you do want to hide in this game, in these maps, I can find you. I can seek. I have a particular set of skills that lets me hunt noobs. I will see you. I will find you. And I will kill you. That's what I'm gonna do. Who tell that bad boy in the corner to get from Ronya? Cause we in danger. Well, look at this. Not a lot of started just staying still a little bit. Woo, two piece, huh? Not a lot of just started sitting still, figuring out how I wanna rush and uh, doing it like this, man. The game is just so much more enjoyable. Should I have to play a game a certain way to enjoy? Get out the doorway, man. Um, I, I feel like I shouldn't have to, but this is how they made the game. But one thing I do love about it is the feet. Like um, like my boy at the murder show say, defeating this game, man, they are so loud. And look at what my team did, man. I dropped the doggone, I dropped the veto, and I'm like, bro, stop going outside. You're going outside, let the veto kill him. You know what I'm saying? These dudes, I, I don't know what they're doing. Jay-Z fans back for it. No good. But uh, defeating this game is so loud on these other maps that people can hear you coming from a mile away on this map. 
If you listen, if you listening for feet, he got me right there. If you're listening for feet, the the action is so fast paced that if you're listening for feet, if you're listening for the, the galoshes, the go, 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 if you're listening for all that stuff, man, you're probably gonna get killed. You have to trust your eyes on this map. It ain't really no no just sit there and listen and wait and all of that good stuff, man. So like like right 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 here, this dude right here, I don't know what he was doing. The other dude was blinking right there. He listening for feet. He not gonna get me because because of the fact that it's just so condensed. It's so many people in one place, in one area, and it's just like, nah, brother, you ain't gonna do it. Now, this dude right here wanted to run around with a shotgun and be a little bitch, but it's all good because we had something for him later on in the game. Um, I think I got tired of that and just let him know, bro, you think you're nice with the shotgun? I'm gonna let you know how nice I am right here. He probably got me too. Woo, hip fire. You'll get caught up in it. Hip fire. Head fire! Then he came right back and bodied my, my... But look, though, like I said, to me, right now, this is one of the best Call of Duties I've ever played. I'm not going to lie to you. The tick rate is trash. I'm not going to lie about that. We, uh, You know, my guy, he did all the information on that. It's like a 24 tick rate instead of being the, uh, the, the 30 that we're normally used to or the 60 that it should be for a 60 FPS game. This dude right here with the shotgun, my guy! Oh, no, he had, a, he, had a, uh, he had a gun. He had a regular gun. I'm sorry. But, um, listen, the t it's, not what we, it's not where it should be. But the sound, the movement, how tight the controls are, the automatic aim of, what, hold on, the automatic aim assist probably not not a good thing. But the automatic aim assist, just everything, how the gunplay feels, how how you move, how you can't like if, if they took the aim assist down, look at this dude right here. I don't know what he's doing. Hip, I mean they, they dropped that bitch from the long range. If they would t t tone down the aim assist a little bit and then turn the feet down a little bit, man. I think we'll have a winner on our hands and give us some better maps. The maps are just so, some of the maps are just so atrocious. Jay-Z fades back for hey, No good. And then, look, he walked right over the grenade like that, but I'm gonna drop that long range down the hallway. Oh, the King Slayer, Jamie Lannister, one more time, bye. But I think if they just tone down the feet, and um, I don't care about the working mini map. I know a lot of people do care about the mini map being the way that it is. We want to see shots on it, but I always have my UAVs on deck anyway. Y'all know I run the low streaks. Woo! <laughs> Y'all know I run the low streaks anyway, so I'm not really tripping. But on a map like this, like I said, where you can't really hide and that you can hit people from any range, any distance, you can't just sit around and listen for feet and all of that good stuff. The doors opening and closing don't really make a whole lot of difference. He killed me with the shotgun! I don't know if that's where I got pissed off or not, but he eventually pissed me off. But you don't have to worry about sitting here worrying about people just listening for you around the corner stuff. I love it, man. Look, that was... I think that was it. And now I'm about to take him to Sandy Rabbit's University with the concentration in Odell Willis studies, baby. Because it's about to get on. Shout out to my dog, Chisels Donuts. Can't make that shot, though. That's the only thing about using shotguns you can't just shoot. But like I said, with the loud feet and all that stuff, man, you don't have to worry about it on this map. They tone those down, give us some better maps, and do all of that stuff. I think we got a winner, man. Get dropped. Woo, get dropped in the doorway. And look, this right here, they don't understand what's going on. They don't understand that I'm in the... Then I'm going to get shot from behind. They don't understand that. But, uh, yeah, if they can do that, the main thing about this game that really bothers me is I think the map designs are what's holding it back. We get better maps. unlike Because Ghost was a really good game, too. Get body. Ghost was a really good game, too. So if Ghost maps weren't so trash, the game would have... What are you doing in the hallway? Three-piece? Uh -huh. I am Odell Willis. Four-piece? Uh-huh. But if, if the, you know, the maps and stuff are what, are what I really feel like is holding the game back. So if we can get better map design, as shown, I played the game the other night, and we had the maps like Shoot House. You know, when we were getting the maps like Shoot House, Vacant, Shipment, and um, Crash, you know, all the, all the Call of Duty maps, we were having a ball. But when we started getting the other maps, you know, the, 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 the ones that are not as much fun, I guess I would say, uh, when we started getting the bigger maps that just wasn't that much fun, man, I, I was not having fun. I'm not even going to lie to you. So it's just like, it's like one of those things where you got, and look, your boy put up a 30 piece, boy. Look at this. I'm back on my bully, man. I'm telling y'all, man, we can get this Call of Duty content popping, man. But I look, just like the video, share the video, and you never know who is going to help your boy Sim one love respect. Bless up. But look, this is the thing I'm trying to say. It's hard for me to, y'all know my commentating style. I can never stay on point. I'm always talking about other stuff. I will work on that if y'all just subscribe and keep watching. Look, 30 
kills, 10 deaths. And I was going crazy running around. I could have avoided a lot of those deaths. And like I said, when I took that dude to Sandy Ravage University with a concentration in Odell Willis studies, y'all already know what it is. Put me an Odell Willis down in the bottom, man, if y'all know who Odell Willis is and what he about, man, and if you was here when, uh, when that originated. All I'm saying is this Call of Duty is a pretty good game. It could be the best Call of Duty of all time. The kill streaks actually work halfway. If kill streak, kill streaks got to kill some more too. I'm not gonna lie about that. If the feet weren't as loud, like the murder show say, if the kill streaks were better, a little bit, tone them up a little bit, and then uh, the last thing is the map design got to be. Look, the feet are so loud that people hear you coming from a mile away. That's why when you play on the other maps and stuff, it seems like it's not as fun. If we could tune either. I feel like we either need to tone down the feet or change the map design to be more like these maps where it pretty much nullifies the feet because you don't know where people are coming from and stuff. Like, I think we'll have a real winner on our hands, man. I really do. I think that this game could be the best Call of Duty out. Like I said, mechanically, this is the best Call of Duty I ever played. Mechanically, mechanically, there's nothing wrong with this Call of Duty except for the tick rate but we can get by that we not we not even tripping on that but the, the the places that make people okay with camping the places that make people you know want to camp and not really play the game and all that stuff like that man if we can get rid of those things man and make the game a little bit better i think it'll be a lot a bit better i'm not even gonna lie i'm not even gonna lie to y'all what do y'all think do y'all think that the game itself is bad do you think this is mechanically the best call of duty like the most well put together call of duty we've ever played i think so but at the same time i know i know for a hundred percent sure um but at the same time i know for a hundred percent sure that something else is gonna have to be done man so like i said it might be like ghosts where they have to where the game was good but the maps was killing it so if we get better maps I feel like we'll have a much better game. That's all I'm saying, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. The shotgun was overpowered. They tuned it back. M4, still overpowered, but it's a gun. It's going to be overpowered. Um, You know, it seems like in some regards, they're listening and they realize that they've made a grave mistake with a lot of the things that they did with this game. But at the same time, it's just like, it's just like what I say, what I tell my wife all the time. We're not as far behind as as we think we are, but we're not as close as the powers that be would have us believe we are either. So we're definitely making progress, but we're not as far along as the powers that be would have you believe. Read between the lines on that one, stay woke, man. Hey, uh, like I said, man, leave me a like on this video. If you wanna keep seeing Call of Duty content, let me know, man. I got gameplay after gameplay lined up. We ready to go. It just depends on y'all, man. Thousand likes, next video come out immediately. How about that? As soon as I get a thousand likes, I'm putting out the next video. Let's do it. Can y'all meet that challenge for you, boy? And I'll put class setups and do all that other silly stuff that everybody likes. But I got to do what I got to do to grow, man. So we're going to see if this works. If it don't, it ain't that for me to shut it down, man. But I keep posting Call of Duty because I actually like the game, man. If I like the game, I'll put it up. And uh, if I don't, I won't. And I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town. God speak. Oh man, I ain't even get y'all the yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town, coming to you live with another video. This is gonna be fun, man. I got the camera up. I was, you know, we, we, it's gonna be fun. Let's see what we can do. I'm out. Peace.